Hello, we're going to take a look at broadcasting to your own website using VI Loud or VLoud. So I'm going to call it VI Loud until somebody tells me otherwise. So broadcasting to your website using VI Loud, what do you need to do? What we're going to do is this. I'm going to go over to here and I'm going to tell you that we need to create a YouTube playlist, create a channel on VI Loud and embed that playlist, write a blog post and take that VI Loud information onto the blog post and then go live from Be Live broadcasting to VI Loud and to our website. Okay, so those are the steps. Now they're simple and straightforward. You just do them in sequence and everything will work well. So I'm going to take that off screen and just as a reminder, I'm using Be Live and vi loud those are the two pieces of software both paid and you can use them to broadcast live to your website it's probably one of the best ways to do it call me biased possibly okay so let's go over and start off on youtube this is the youtube uh, studio producer and i want a playlist there which is called Broadcasting Travels and Live. So I'm going to click there to edit it. So this is the playlist that I created earlier, and it's a list of my broadcasts which I've made to Amazon Live. So there you have it's Broadcasting to Amazon Live. So I'm going to copy the title, you'll see why in a moment. But at the moment, that has got four videos on it, and Basically, I'm putting those through to VI Loud and then I can embed a player. OK, so that's the first stage. Have a playlist, take its title and then go over to the VI Loud web page. OK, so this is the main web page and it starts off with channels. We want to add a new channel. OK, so we're going to go create a channel and in a second to come through it is an on-demand channel so people can watch video when they want and it's made from a youtube playlist okay so there's the two options you want to click on demand people can watch when they want and it's from a youtube playlist then go next and first thing it wants is a name now i'm going to paste the name that i just copied broadcasting to amazon live okay and then i need the playlist so let's go back to youtube and to that playlist and if i hit the share button it will in a second come up with the link that i need so i'm going to copy that link from that youtube playlist go back to vi loud and paste in if it will let me i'm going to paste in the link okay now i could set up uh, an icon to go with the playlist as well but i'm just going to accept what's there i can come back and change it later so i've now got a playlist on vi loud and as you can see if i scroll up the playlist is taken VI Loud is taking the four videos in my playlist. Simple as that. As soon as you set up a channel, you put in the playlist URL, it's actually then on VI Loud. That's we've gone from YouTube to VI Loud. Now the next stage is you need to write a blog post. Now, as far as a blog post is concerned, here is one that I started preparing earlier, and you've seen it already. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to add the VI Loud player. So I'm going to go and click on the structure and press plus. And then having pressed plus, I want HTML. Okay, so I'm going to drag the HTML across to there. Okay. And that's now sat waiting for some HTML code. If I go back to VI Loud, there's our new channel at the top. And hopefully,
at the top is broadcasting to Amazon Live. And you can see that I can preview the channel if I wish, or I can embed, and it's the embed code I want. So I click embed, and it comes up with the embed code. Now this is the code which will allow this VI Loud player to work with the playlist that we took from YouTube. Now I always switch off autoplay because I find it annoying when I go to a web page and there's a video player and I don't know where it is and it's playing sound. Now I'm going to copy that code from VI Loud, go to my blog post and paste it in. And in a second or two, uh, it's got to talk, they've got to talk to each other, get, get acquainted, and then in a second it will come through. And there's my VI Loud player with the Amazon Live videos on it. So we've done that, and what I'm going to do at this stage is I'm going to update the blog post. So let's just, let's just recap. Recapping is always a good idea. We started with a YouTube playlist. We then went to VI Loud, we created a channel, we put that playlist onto the channel, and then we took the embed code from VI Loud, and we put it in the blog post, and the blog post now has the player in it. There's the player, and if I press play, hopefully, fingers crossed, then the video would come through. But I'm going to, videos. okay, there you are. I'm going to stop that. So it's, all, it's all already playing the video. Okay. So if I go to preview, and this is the preview page. This is, what, sure I'm live. this is what the blog post looks like. Facebook, which is good. And the video. In three, two. One, ready to go live and live. Okay, there's the so video player. The Come back to here. Over there. Because this is this is started. I'm going to stop that. My apologies for for that actually playing. Um, here's the blog post, and it has the video player embedded in it. Now, I would actually sort of pad this out with more images and what have you but for the moment we've got the video player now the the wonderful thing about vi loud is that if i go live to vi loud instead of playing the videos this page will now play my live broadcast and this is what it's all about where i want to go live on a on a, sorry you don't want the guardian do you <laughs> this is recorded live, by the way. We want to go live on our web page. So I'm going to go to the VI Loud page again. And have I managed to close it? Okay. Just one be a second. I'm going to go to the VI Loud page again. Oh, it's there now. Right, okay, so I've got the embed code, that's all sorted and dusted. I now need to go live. And this is the live stream settings. Now, what we need to do here, this is the daily live streams. And this is where we're going to be streaming to. We stream to this page, and it streams to all all the pages are blog post. Now I want to add my new channel, which is broadcasting to Amazon Live. Accept. So I can add channels here at any time. I've got 10, 11 different web pages. If I go live on one, I'm going live on them all. This is the way that it works. So this is the live screen on VI Loud. Now what I want to do on in my studio is to create a destination and it's going to be an RTMP destination. In other words, we're going to connect to VI Loud using RTMP. And for that, we just need two pieces of information from the VI Loud site. 
we need the URL. So I've copied the URL and I'm going to paste it into there. And we need the stream key. Now stream key is unique to you. Don't share it with anybody ever. Uh, okay, so I'm going to key in the stream key. Now the thing that I managed to do there is I managed to mix up the URL. So that's my uh, helpful uh, password software helping me. So there's the RTMP link and it's now no longer yellow. There is the key. I'm in the BeLife Studio. I've just keyed those two pieces of information in and I'm going to save that. Okay. Now in the studio, I'm ready to go live. VI Loud is offline and not doing anything. And now I'm going to go live and we'll follow this through. Yeah, and then I'll recap afterwards. If you've missed a beat, then just watch the video again. There will be written instructions down below as well. But what we're doing is we're going to go live from our studio to the website. So let's press start and confirm that we're going live. Okay, now I'm in the BeLive studio and in a second I will get a 321, a countdown to say that my signal is being received by the servers at BeLive and is then going to be forwarded where I, to whichever destinations I want it sent to. Now, I'm live in the studio, you're watching me live. My signal has gone out to the BeLive studios. It takes 20 to 30 seconds for that signal to be processed and go on to its destination. And this is because you could have a broadcast where you've got four people on screen and all those individual signals, those four signals need to be composited before they're sent out. Yeah. Now I could equally well, it's the same routines if you go live on Facebook and YouTube, but this time we're going live to VI Loud. So hopefully I've talked through that and there I am. Uh, after a second, this is the VI Louds page we looked at earlier. And that's me talking away with my hands, of course. And the broadcast has got to VI Loud. It's gone from the BeLive Studio to VI Loud. Now, we embedded the code into our web page. So if we go to the web page and press play, then after a second or two, videos, two to three minutes, that should be. To give I'm, just to gonna, I'm just going to refresh the page. Make sure that I'm okay. Right. So I'm now on the web page, and the web page, just to prove it, I'm going to go press the play button. This is me live. So what has happened is that from my studio here, the signal has gone to be live. Be live have sent it to VI Loud, and I'm live on the VI Loud site. And then I've embedded the code for this player into a blog post, which means that I'm live on the blog post. Now, it does mean that you can, when you're going to go live on your website, you just need the link to this blog post. That's all you need to give people. You're going to say to people, I'm going to be live on my website on Wednesday at 2 p.m. Here's the link. It's a permanent link. It doesn't change like the Facebook link changes. And you are genuinely live on your website. Now, whilst you're live, VI Loud will make a recording. That recording you can download afterwards after the, the broadcast is finished or be a recording which you can download from VI Loud. Your website will revert back to the original playlist as soon as you've finished, okay, until you go live again. Now, if you go back to VI Loud for a moment, we went live on the uh, broadcasting timers and live page but I'm also live on other pages. There's no limit to the number of places that you can embed this web player. You can embed it in your own pages. Okay, now I've got seven shows a week, so it's embedded in all seven. You can embed it on other websites, your own websites or your contacts websites. You can embed this player anywhere so that when you go live, 
you're live on your website. Okay, why is that important? I'll come back to me to finish off. We spent years broadcasting to other destinations and earning money for other people. If you can broadcast to your website, I've just shown step by step how to do it, then people are going to watch you on your website. It's going to be, it's not going to be easy. You can't just, you've got to attract an audience. You've got to build an audience. You've got to promote it. You've got to push it. You've got to be pushy. If you do that, then what will happen is this. Over time, you'll gather an audience. And in actually, whilst watching your live video, they'll be exploring your website, reading your blog posts, visiting your shop, finding out more about you, coming to know, like, and trust you. You're live on your website. At the moment, you're going to be one of the very few people doing it. So now is the time to push. Right, this has been, I go off here, a demonstration of BeLive and VI Load. Okay, so I'm going RTMP out of VI Load. So let's just recap. Okay, on VI Load, sorry, let's go back to the beginning. It all started with a playlist. We took the link for the playlist and we create the channel on VI Loud and we put the link in. Now, having put the link, the create the channel, we embedded that channel in a blog post. And that meant that when we go live on VI Loud, we go live on our website. I'll put more detailed instructions, but essentially that is it. If you've got this far in the video, then I'd like to say, congratulate you. If you need any help with going live on VR Loud, then just let me know. You can find me everywhere. Uh, just so you know, this is me. And no, not that. Okay. <laughs> that is me. And you can contact me and ask me questions about Be Live and VR Loud anytime. Uh, I love the software. It simply works. It's so simple and straightforward to set up. And once you've set it up, it will run forever. Um, and you can go live on as many web pages as you like using the same embed code once you've got it set up. So take care and thank you for listening. And uh, I'm just going to hope that I can stop this now. <laughs> okay, so that's VI Loud. Bye.